Hey y'all, it's a costume jeweler headed into the red, white, and blue thrift store, Hillsboro Avenue, Tampa, looking for purses, jewelry, knickknacks, whatnots, doodads, and trinkets to pick up for resale on YouTube live sales. We haven't had one last week or this weekend because I'm getting ready to head out of town. So I apologize for that. So haven't had any sales recently. They're usually on Saturdays at 8.30 or 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So don't forget that thumbs up for this video. Also, subscribe to the channel during those live sales i sell things below retail value so i thrift smart bring those to you for less than retail less than market we also have lots of giveaways last time i had a sales like seven giveaways usually have three or four at least i'm gonna head to round top texas um and have a lot of fun there shopping along a two-lane farm to market make sure y'all bring cash thrift um, red, white, and blue thrift only accepts cash. And no guarantees, ladies, no guarantees, but you know we always looking. We always are looking. Not sure what ones are half off today. I don't think I've ever seen a Victoria's Secret backpack. This place can be a hit or miss. There's your Brighton bag. Hit or miss. Usually it's a hit. Look at this beautiful spring bag here. What is this? Oh, look at this. It's Vera Bradley. Now that is a pretty spring bag. We may have to think about that one. So y'all know from watching the channel, I don't usually pick up Vera Bradley's, but I like them if they're solid colors. This one's awful pretty, so we're going to carry it around if you see anything that I did purchase or you think I purchased. Just shoot me an email. I'll give you a price quote unless I'm not near my inventory. walk down through these aisles and see if there's any trinket boxes jewelry boxes anything unusual we can't live without because you never know I like this one I'm not going to get it but this jewelry box is kind of cool I could use that for my seal inside it has that gold color this is kind of a nice piece not sure what you'd do with it Looks like a collage that somebody put together. Maybe hold letters, not sure. This one's nice. It's just that it's got some beads that are loose. What is this one? Wallets. Brand Puritan Pass. This one's nice. This one's called J Fold. It's pretty red. Look at this tooled one though. People ask me about wallets all the time, and I don't have them that often. That's a nice one too. I just don't always see a lot of men's stuff out at the thrift. It's mainly ladies' items. getting this one y'all it's Jack George's Jack George's is a great brand we are going to pack this one up pretty nice crossbody so if you ever see that brand right there get it get it if it's in good condition Dooney some days you can walk in and hit a home run not all the time, but the majority of it. Michael Kors. It's a nice one. So this is a Wahlborg beaded bag. And look how nice this is. It has mother of pearl. Inside's good condition. You got the mother of pearl right there. I think I'm going to have to pack this one up, y'all. So here's the back of it. Look at that. You have abalone shell right there. And look at the design here on the front. So you see the shell. Look how pretty that is. I think that's one we need to take home. That is in good condition. Not sure what the year is on it. Pretty heavy clutch there. 
a little bit different. Look at this Spartina. Is it going to be in good shape? It's a little bit dirty. Good brand. Not going to get it though. It's a sparkle. Lots of different perfumes and colognes. Look at that. Roaches are wiped out today, and I'm betting the color is not blue. A bag full of cash. Never know what you're going to find in this case. And some days coming in here and not finding something is not always a bad thing. It's still fun to look. Remember that chunky monkey from last week? That's a lot of sterling right there. I think it's Cuban chain, isn't it? Look at that diamond ring, $400. Probably topaz there, gold bracelets. What watches do they have? What is this one? Raymond Wheel. Might be a Rolex. more gold so purses behind the counter I think we're gonna just gloss over those today Some days are better than others of when to come in. What is this necklace here? But really, you just never know. Just whenever you can get down here is when you should come down here. This is pretty. This is real pretty. Look at this one. I love that. Oh my gosh. That is gorgeous. So this one right here is really nice too, but I'm not sure I'm going to get it because the gold tone is decent condition. There's a little bit of fading that feels like real glass or crystal. But we are for sure getting this one. So this is double stranded, probably about 36 inches long. Look how pretty that is. I don't think there's ever any use for this, y'all. What do y'all think? Do you think there's really use for one of these? In my humble opinion, I'm thinking no. No. Okay, I don't know if this is real or not. Look at this one. Sitting over here, just out in the wild. This is their high-end clothing section up here by the front, by the jewelry. We're going to run down one of these aisles over here, see if there's any knickknacks. So I just met another nice lady and her daughter. They watch the channel. Her name is Miss Smarty. She doesn't come in. She comes into the chat some. She watches the lives. She watches the videos. So I told her to come on into the chat. She said she loves the hen den. So hopefully she'll come into the chat and hang out with us. These purses just get put everywhere. Look at that beautiful Brighton right there with the red. I tell you, I meet more people with the red, white, and blue than anywhere else. Wow, look at this. Now we're get talking. We're looking like we got lots of trinkety stuff everywhere. Love this box right here. Look at this. So this is some kind of a wood, but 
It says Ecuador on it, but I still like that one. What do y'all think? Can a person ever have too many jewelry boxes? These plates right here run pretty expensive online. What I've done with them is decorate with them. Wow, I like that too. This would be very cool in the fishing room, the Airbnb, but we are starting to fill that room up on the walls. I, can never, I never know when to stop or how many pieces I need, if you know what I mean. CC, she was quite the model in the day. It's a pretty nice little piece right there. Ooh, now I have lots of these, y'all. Look at this. Y'all know I love my taxidermy. It's too bad there's not a price on this one because I probably would pack that up. What is this right here? It looks like a purple paperweight. Now, I've never seen any paperweight quite this big. I know a lot of people in the channel love purple. This is a nice one, so I think we're going to get it to... These little paperweights right here I'm going to get because you can put pictures right in the bottom. So you can get your old photographs, put them in there where you can see them on top. For that reason, I love those too. So we're going to get those as well. Last Supper Crystal. <clears throat> I don't know if you need or have to have or should have the um, light for good reflection. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Tell you what, I'm gonna knock everything over. Look at this cat. I think he's a cute cat. I think he wants to go home. It's a little different. I always tend to miss the top shelf. Gotta to remember to look up. Remember to look up. Never know. These perfume bottles right here. I think these are perfume bottles, y'all. Let's see, they're precious moments perfume bottles. Not sure if they're worth money or not. Is she holding a little chicken? Oh no, it's a what is that? So are those worth money or not? Y'all comment below and let me know. So it's precious moment. Precious Moments Perfume Bottles. Oh, no you didn't. Come on now. So this one's cracked, otherwise I would probably pack it up. It's cracked on the bottom. Little cute purse trinkety thing. Here is a face trinket box, y'all. Look at this one. I'm going to get this for sure. I love that. Face trinket box. Never had one of those before, but now I do. What is this? I like this one, but I think I'm going to pass on it. It's a cute little purse. What is this? No idea. See, look at all these cars. Oh my gosh. It's little model cars. Mm -hmm. 
so spoiled from last week. Finding a lot of stuff. Liz Claiborne. See that snake print or faux snake print? Always makes me look. Made me look for sure. Vegan leather, brand new. Well, not sure if Wednesday is the day to come in here. Never know. Briefcases are always on the back racks. Oops. I've seen this brand before right here. I've packed it up before, but we're not gonna get that one because it's dirty. It's dirty, but that is a good brand. If you ever looking, Cat Kidston, don't leave that behind unless it's not in good condition. I don't always pull all of these out. Probably should, but I don't. Let's kind of look around them a little bit. I am sure there's things I've missed in the past, and that's okay. This right here is National Potteries. Look at this, y'all. National Potteries, and this has got to be the cutest Siamese cat. It reminds me of Lucky, Dow Stars Kitty right there, and her mama. We've got to name her mama. She's the, the Siamese, or the, I think it's Siamese out of the Airbnb. Isn't that adorable? You ever wanting candlesticks this place always has them just never know what they're gonna have in here let's see if there's any glassware that looks vintage vintage looking for vintage glassware thing right here. Oh, made in China. I thought that was old. I thought that was vintage. Oil lamp. Uh, it looks like it has peppers in it to me. Well, that's kind of cool. It's a rooster oil lamp. We used to have oil lamps when electricity go out. My dad would Turn them on. I just don't think I'd do that today. Butterfly coasters. What else? Hello, pretty. Well, hello back to you. You're so pretty, too. Thank you. Appreciate that comment. All right, y'all. I guess we're going to get out of here. We've looked around, looked around. What is this piece right here? What does that say? Nice little dish. So don't forget to subscribe, like, share, hit that notification bell, click all. Make sure that bell turns black so you're notified of these video uploads as well as my live sales. My shopping across the United States, including Texas, coming up. It's going to be fun at Round Top, Texas. If any of you are in Round Top, Texas, or are going to be comment below that is at the end of March so next Friday and Saturday I'll be out there looking around for rusty treasures jewelry purses knickknacks whatnots doodads and trinkets what 
does this say right here? Subscribe the channel and thumbs up for the video. And look at that. You could use that for jewelry. We'll see y'all later. Thank you again. Bye.